Hello, yes, another video where I've not clipped my beard. I'm going to do it later though. I just don't have time. So, we're doing Turkey Twizzlers. If you've not read the title, you're thinking, what's new about that? Well, apparently these are new. I've got them in Iceland. Turkey Twizzlers, Christmas turkey and stuffing flavour. Look at them. Now, I'm not going to go too much into the consistency because the turkey twizzler is a turkey twizzler is a turkey twizzler you all had them i'm sure and you've all complained about the texture and you've all complained about the flavor and you've all said they're not as good as they used to be but do these actually taste like turkey and stuffing yeah it's ripped because they're in the oven at the minute two of them for me to dry so just add gravy it says just add gravy um surely you're going to have them with chips Hmm. They're just about ready in the oven, so I'm going to be back just like that. So they're done. Look, look at them. Now it says on the box, put in the oven, let the magic unfurl. For your delight, the Twizzler uncurls. Is it just me that every time I've cut these for a review, I've had to pull them apart to get them to go that springy shape? Because they stick together and they don't uncurl like it says on there. Is it just me that seems to have bad luck with turkey twizzlers? I don't know. Now, flavour-wise, it says on there, chopped and shaped turkey with added water. Is that flavour in there? Seasoned with sage, onion and cranberries. Why do you have to put the cranberries in? Sage and onion, stuffing. I don't mind cranberries, I like them. But I don't want them in everything at Christmas. Right, let's see what they taste like then. Yeah, definitely that usual texture of them and the dry. No, they're not overcooked for anyone that says it's just the texture of turkey twizzlers. They're just always dry, always dry. Let's see. Just so you know, we're on a run of thumbs ups at the minute. I don't know what order the videos are going up, but there is an unsure coming up, but there's no, been no downs for a while. You know where we're going with this. Right, using my fingers, not my fork. Fingers are invented before forks. Smell wise, oh yeah, nothing. Very, very slight smell of the turkey, whatever they're putting in it. It's not turkey breast. If anybody's done a review, I've not looked at any other reviews on this. If anybody said, yeah, that smells really strong of turkey and stuffing. Taste wise, I can actually see bits on there. I don't know if you can. See them little bits? I think they're cranberries. But, it's like skin off a of cranberry. There's no actual pieces of the, the cranberry. As for the turkey and stuffing, obviously I can taste the turkey because the turkey twizzlers, well, what reconstitutes itself as turkey. And for the stuffing, they need to add some. I can't taste stuffing. Yeah, if anyone's said on these, anyone you know or whatever, have said, yeah, I've done these, I've had them, and they're really nice, they taste the turkey and stuff in, good luck to you, because I can't get any. It's a bland, dry, and it's not been overcooked. Oh, it's squidgy. Just a bland, dry, tasteless turkey twizzler. Now, I know I'm one of these that turkey twizzlers used to be banging back in the day, and I'm sure they used to be a lot bigger than that. But maybe it's because you're young, you like them. I don't know. But of all the ones I've tried just lately, uh, eh, yeah. I think one of them I said was all right. I can't remember what I said on them, but I hope Zeus likes it because there's seven in here now that he's got to have. Ah, thumbs down, don't like it, dry, tasteless, sooner eat a Richmond sausage. If you like this video, which probably you ain't, give us a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. If this is the first time you're watching the video, you probably won't watch anymore. I don't know. So oh, he's miserable, telling it like it is. And share the channel and drop your comments in. Have you tried these? What did you think, honestly? And 
If not, are you going to try her? Don't let the fact that I've given my thumbs down and said the tasteless blur there. Try them and see. You've got to try and make your own mind up as well. Because you can't just believe the words of someone sat in front of a camera waffling on about what they taste like. Your taste buds might be different. So don't take it as gospel what we say or what anybody says. Go and try them for yourself and see what you think. We'll catch you on the next one.